Hello friends, how are you all doing? I hope you are doing your best wherever you are. Today I want to show you around my city, Aachen. Before moving to the city, I would like you to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done already and hit the bell icon. So, Aachen. Aachen is the cap was the capital of uh, French Emperor Charlemagne. And there has been 31 kings and 12 queens have been coronated here. They have been crowned here. So, Aachen is also UNESCO's heritage city and it holds a very his big historical importance in the history of Germany and French both. So, uh, Angela Merkel, uh, uh, this German Chancellor and French President uh, Macron, they always come here to Aachen once a year to celebrate the history of Aachen. Aachen is at the border of Netherlands and Belgium. In Netherlands, Aachen is known as Aachen. And in Belgium, in French region, it is known as Aix-la-Chapelle. And it is a very beautiful historical city. In 1st century AD, Roman soldiers used to come here to enjoy the hot water springs. And in 8th century, why Charle, uh, French Emperor Charlemagne made it its capital? Because he loved its thermal baths and spas. So that is how... Uh, famous it was even in, then in so long ago it's uh, his cathedral church i told you it is it was built in 8th century so it is such an old church though it was destroyed in world war ii but it has been restored and it looks very beautiful and all the travelers all the tourists from all over the world when they come to europe they make one stop it is compulsory that they will make a one stop here and they will go to Aachen Dom to just see it it's so beautiful so i will show you around my city and i hope you will like it as much as i do let's go for dome i will make a separate video cathedral church that is but today i will just drive you through the city because dome needs a altogether a different video it's a very beautiful church and i want to show you to you in detail today is sunday so there is less traffic on the roads You can see there are not many high-rise buildings here, small buildings, but very sophisticated and very developed. On the left-hand side, there are uh, very big restaurants. Here are the car testing agencies to test the quality of the car.
and here there are the uh, shopping malls where we can buy the construction related things so you can see a yellow build, uh, building there that is a stadium tivoli it is a world famous stadium it has sitting capacity of 32000 people and very big games are played here football games and in front we have chio chio is also world class the uh, horse uh, running competitions are held here it is equivalent to your wimbledon tennis and it is very prestigious in front we have our finance office so this is the other side of the stadium tivoli you can see chio once a year they do horse racing competitions here and uh, championships are held so it's very world famous For motorcycles, there is no separate lane, but there is a separate lane for the bicycles. So this is the city center park here it is called Eurogress and uh, there is very world famous theater many plays are uh, played here and also for opera and many musical performances are done here concerts and there is also a very big park here today i am driving you just with the through the car so i will not be able to show you from inside but i will i'm just showing you around the city on right hand side there is a very big park and here it is the theater you can see here in the front for all the concerts and operas and people really come here and enjoy This is more or like the city center of the city, residential area, but this is in the middle of the city. On the right hand side, there is a very big shopping mall, Aqui Plaza.
Look, here is a bicycle. Bicycle has a separate lane. From outside, you can think that it is not so developed, but inside the equipments available, the quality of the buildings, it's very world class, very high. So now I will show you the bus station of Aachen. Here it is the main bus station of Aachen. On the left hand side there are some hotels. And many restaurants also are here. Look on the other side of the light on the right hand side there then there is a bus stand main bus station so on the left hand side is the city center where are all the main shops There are also many driving schools in Aachen, very expensive, but compulsory to join them. So on the right hand side, you can see one golden lady. This is the statue and very beautiful sculpture. So in front, you can see all the city center shops. It is not very expensive to live in the city center, but it is very crowded on normal days. Parking is difficult to find. And it's very old built, not very new. But they keep on renovating the buildings. So from here starts the university area. University is not limited to one building, like one campus. It is located throughout the city in different, different campuses, different, different buildings, different departments are located. But university is really very famous here of Aachen. It's a technical university, means technology. Innovations are very well promoted here. I will show you the building where uh, Angela Merkel, German Chancellor and French President Macron come every year to celebrate the history of Aachen. Actually to celebrate the anniversary of the crowning of the kings. It's actually a very old school building. Yeah, it was on the right hand side. I could not show you properly, but that was where it was. From here, you can see the church. Actually, it is a pontor, uh, the gate of the Aachen from where this uh, celebration of the ceremony of the king started. On the right hand side. Yeah, this is the gate. 
from where the celebration started. You can call it Gateway of Arkhan. Yeah, on right hand side there are again university buildings of different departments like student helping center is also there. So this is the auditorium building of Aachen University on the left hand side. It's very modern from inside. All the world class things are available here, facilities are here for students. Quality of education is very advanced. So now I'm showing you the Lent Chocolate Factory. This is a factory where the chocolates are produced. There is a, a factory outlet of this Lent Chocolates here. Chocolates are available at cheaper rates. Factory outlet rates and uh, it's very good. On the right hand side was also the for the biscuits factory outlet center. So you can buy in bulk quantities at the cheaper rates. Quality is also good. So now I'm going to show you thermal bath here where uh, it is very famous for its mineral water springs and it is very relaxing to take bath here. It is on the right hand side of uh, the street. There is also a very big park, Oero Grace Park, which I told you it is the other side of that park.
So this, so this was the Carlos thermal bath, very famous for its thermal springs. Now on the Shtavag is the electrical provider of Aachen city. It is a basic provider, though there are different companies who supply the electricity. There is no monopoly. There is no state government electricity here. It is supplied through different companies. On the right hand side is the Ludwig Forum. Many painting exhibitions are held here. It's also very famous for arts, museum and everything. Cyclists are given priority to cross the road and people really love to ride bicycles here. If you want to see some particular support spot in Aachen or in Germany or you have any questions related to this city then please write to me in the comment box I will be happy to answer them. I'm living in this city for the last four years so I don't know everything about this city and if you think I missed some point I missed something then please let me know in the comment box.
Here there is also the Ford Research Center. There are many software companies here and also car manufacturing companies. Because of the lockdown, I will not be able to show you so, so many things in so much detail. But once a lockdown is lifted and you have any particular question, I will be happy to solve your query. Please do let me know if you have any questions relating to Germany lifestyle or Germany education, cost of living. I will be happy to answer all your questions. Look, it's so beautiful and so calm and relaxed here. Not much traffic. Yeah, because it is Sunday and then there is lockdown also. Lockdown is not so strict here. We can still go ar around and about and uh, there is not much problems. But still, some offices are still closed. It is a tunnel. We are going through the tunnel. And this is the way to the hospital actually. It is university, it is called Uni Clinic University Hospital. And it's very big. It is actually the single largest building in whole Europe. So near the um, hospital building, there is also a teacher and training center for all the medical students. Many patients of Corona from France, Austria, they are being treated here in this uniclinicum. That is hospital. Look, this is the building of the hospital. Doesn't look that fancy, will not be like that. But inside the equipment, the facilities are world class. Many patients have been treated here. Because Germany itself has not so many cases, so it is also taking patients from all over the Europe. If they need help, they are airlifted here and then they are treated here. From the border countries, whenever it is possible.
this we have again come to the chio this is a bridge of that chio that horse racing stadium here are all the furniture shops where we can buy the furniture it's like ikea substitute we don't have any ikea in aachen but we do have in our border country netherlands so we normally go there when we want to but naturally not at this time where social distancing is not possible there on those places we don't go now i want to show you the farmhouse from where we can even buy the milk and they have horses they have cows we can buy fresh vegetables there it is a big farmhouse milk is a bit expensive than the buying from supermarket but it's fresh and of good quality and they have very big dangerous dogs they were proper farmer life but they are well protected here their life is good here in germany because their rights are respected and they get good price for their produce and people like to buy from them because it is organic it is fresh even though if it is expensive so this is a farmhouse on the left hand side there is the farmhouse it's very big cows and uh, eat grass here and so they are roaming freely so you know with good quality milk is produced when cattle is happy animals are happy that is what they believe in that happy animals produce also happy meat not in the caged they should also have a life in nature so there is a statue of cow here look on that building top and this is a farmhouse there are cars here to buy milk and fresh vegetables i am not showing so much in detail because video is already very long and uh, i want to just show you a glimpse but if you have any query i will tell you to please share to me in the comment box i will be happy to answer your any query regarding the city or in germany her lifestyle or cost of living any questions you have please write to me in the comment box and i will be happy to answer them this is also a very big shopping center here on the right hand side now it is closed the entry was closed now i'm showing you the football club where my son used to go though he doesn't go now but it is a very big football club here
so you can see on the right hand side where we throw the glasses it is a brown glass different green glass different container and for white glass it is a different container so they sort out really their garbage very well even empty glass bottles are sorted out according to the color so this is the football club today is sunday so people at uh, the football club is closed as such but people have come here to play tennis or just having a walk or do a jogging so this is the empty football ground so now we are going back look at the back side of that car there is a cycle so people will stop the car and if they have a chance to ride the bicycle they will ride the bicycle in the area just for fun so with this i will be ending my video if you like this video then please hit the like button and share it with your family and friends do subscribe to my channel if you haven't done already and write to me in the comment box your queries your opinions or your suggestions what would you like to watch on my channel i will see you in my next video till then take care bye bye stay healthy stay happy and stay blessed bye bye